Okay, welcome to my uh, latest video here of uh, Tobar. This is just the box that I'm showing you here, just to see what it came in. It's just the Tobar that I bought off eBay for my van. So, just unboxing it, the bits and pieces that come with it. You know, blah blah blah. So, here's obviously the main piece of the Tobar. It's the frame. It's not as actual heavy as you think, but a really robust piece of kit. It's a, uh, if I can pronounce it right, Umbra Gansi Tobar from Italy. And this then is just uh, the cap because the ball is actually removable on this one. Just by chance, you just take off the cover, that slots in, have a little handle here then, and it locks and unlocks the ball, and you can remove the ball, which is quite good, I, I think, you know. So. That the, anyway, is the main bar that will be going on the back of the van, and then here it comes with these obviously brackets, which once again are quite, you know, go on like that. Obviously, the opposite way around because the van is this is the bit that sticks out the front brackets. Obviously, the hardware seems quite good too with it. Book of instructions is. Fairly, fairly thick as it goes through all different languages, and whatever, and there it's quite well laid out and quite well done to show fitting instructions and, and whatever. But you know, as to how it goes together and bits and pieces like that. Now, obviously, my van is quite new, it's 2013, so I also needed a bypass relay, which thankfully came in this kit. If you are fitting this to a fairly modern car, you you will have to get the bypass relay. It stops the you know the bulb warning light and all that kind of stuff coming on and going off and whatever. It just makes it an awful lot better to do this. Here then, length cable because you have to give it a 12 volt supply. That's probably going to be the hardest part of the install is to get the 12 volt from the fuse box at the front of the van, obviously all the way to the back, but um. I go through that when I'm fitting it. Do you know, I have a couple of little hints and tips about that. And then obviously here is just my pre-wired socket connector, which is you know it's handy enough. And the cable doesn't seem that long, to be honest. But in fairness, that there's a fair bit there. I thought it might be a bit short, but no, there's a fair bit there. And um, we just have little clips, grommets. Here's obviously the bypass relay instructions, which are quite good, very well laid out, you know. And obviously we go through more of this when I'm actually fitting it to the van and removing the bumper and uh, all that kind of stuff. I'll go in depth with all of these little bits and pieces, what they do, where they go, and whatever. As I said, this is just an unbox to give you an idea as to what comes in the box, what to expect and all that and to just give you a little run through of the brief instructions brief bits and pieces okay thanks for watching